Hello, Little Theatrics. This episode was brought to you by Pepsi Max and Staffordshire Terriers. As you can imagine, because it's the new year, this video comes in many, many parts. Hello. Part 1, Doctor Who. End of time, part 1 came on Christmas Day, and all I have to say about that is what the hell was that? Essentially, you should have seen it by now, and if you haven't, I'm going to spoil you. So, go away and watch it if you haven't seen it already. Okay? Jumping Squirrel Master, Electric Powers Master, Master taking over the whole human race, and everyone else becoming the Master. The whole thing of part 1 was absolutely ridiculous. The makeup part? The cafe scene. I'm going to die. Well, so am I one day. Don't you dare. All right, I'll try not to. <laughs> On to part two, which coincidentally is me reviewing part two of the of end of time. Isn't that coincidental? Ha 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 ha. So, 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 so much better. Um, really awesome stuff. Cactuses saving the day. Oh, cacti, sorry. Typical doctor action, running, hiding. Um, Doctor going really G.I. Joe on us and jumping out of the jet to land in. And personally, I am actually really glad that the Time Lords didn't come back because, frankly, that would have killed the whole element of the show, which is a new star and the Time Lords are dead. I really don't think it would work. This is me personally. I'm sure someone like the Moffat could probably make it work, but he chose not, he chose not to have it that way, and I respect that. Go for it. It's actually rather symbolic. I, on the last time I saw End of Time Part 2, we went to a big screening and I was dressed as the Doctor in my finalized Doctor costume, which I will put a link to in the sidebar. And that was a big screening and it was very, very symbolic for me personally because I have made my niche inside the cosplay world of Australia through this character. And now he is no longer the Doctor. He is past tense. So it's quite sad. And in a way I really wish he never did have to go, but in the end everyone goes. So let's um, make the best of it, okay? Part 3. I am officially a member of Griffith University. Look, you can see my face there. Yay! It's interesting actually because if you look at all my cards, this is the first card I got um, to prove my identity in the future. Not sure if you can see that, but very young looking. Then onto this one where I had my hair cut for um, a Shaun of the Dead thingy. And then this one, which you've just seen. So despite my appearance, I am actually still aging. Excellent! I think that's everything that you possibly need to know about my life right now. More videos coming in the future. Um, go watch Reaper, the genetic opera. Um, go read the Aragon series. Um, and go drink Pepsi Max. You know what? These guys should actually pay for me for this. Oh well.